Let's learn how to save all open files in Photoshop in this quick and simple tutorial. So as you can see in Photoshop here, I have three PSD files that I would like to save all at the same time. And it doesn't matter whether you have three files or 300 open, the process is exactly the same. So with all your files open, go to File, Scripts and Image Processor. Now with the image processor options open, make sure you've got your use open images selected. You can either then save in the same location or you can select a specific folder to save to. So I'm going to select folder and I'm going to make sure this saved to my images folder. Press open. Now to run this script, you have three file type options. You can save as JPEG, which you can see here. You can set your quality as you would export a JPEG from 0 to 12, depending on the quality of the image you want and the file size. You can keep the dimensions as you are, or you can resize to fit and set the dimensions here. And you can convert your color profile to sRGB, or you can include this ICC profile, depending on your preference. So I'm going to save these as JPEG. Now you can also include PSD and TIFF versions. So I know these are already saved as Photoshop files. For the sake of this exercise, I will also save every image as a PSD and I will set the maximize compatibility option on. I'm not going to cover this in this tutorial, but you can also run some actions as well. So if I select this, you can see there's a number of different options you can add here. Cast shadow, add a wood frame, save as Photoshop PDF. There's a lot of options here. So there's some things for you to look at, but I'm just going to leave those off. I just want to save these as JPEG. And then once I'm happy with my options, then I'm simply going to press run. And now the script is running and saving my images. So once the script has run, your files will be saved. So I'm come over to my images folder. And now you can see I've got two folders saved. I've got JPEG here. It saved all three images as JPEGs. And it's also created a Photoshop file folder for me with three separate PSDs. So this script is a fantastic way to potentially save tens or even hundreds of files as JPEGs all at the same time. So particularly if you work with lots of photography or files for web where you have to use the same image multiple times, this trick can save you so much time. So there you have it. It's that simple to save all open files as JPEGs, PSDs or TIFFs in Photoshop using one simple script. So I hope you found this tutorial helpful. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Keep on designing and I'll see you for the next tutorial.